Okay, so this tutorial is again another series for Revit applications. So previously we already covered the Py Revit, R RTV, R R RF tools, and now we're going to D roots also finish and beam one. So we're going to IDH hardware. This one, what will be the the smart automation process that we can use and apply into a Revit workflow. So this application, idea software is I think the most expensive, but uh, they are also I think the the best uh, uh, automation application that can be used from sheets, parameter information, push and push and pull back from Revit to Excel, and also you have the sheets, revisions, you can extract and show from Excel, so we cover that in this uh, 15 minutes tutorial for this topic, IDH software. So, okay, so let's start. So, beam link, when you select beam link, the demo mode, because I'm working from home, so you, similar to other applications, you can select or you can uh, load sample from other, from their uh, location, default template location. So, for example, uh, I would say they have also Kobe floor system, Kobe type. You can go to like, say, let's go to air terminals okay let's double click this one next and it will load here so this is all the air, air terminals default settings so if you maximize this one so you have the that one so you can add also from the parameters from rabbit so this that's the default you can select the shoe full preview so that you will see all the air terminals as shown in the similar to the excel so that's all the terminals okay you have level type can do that. so all this information here when you export this one when you this one when you when you select done right and then since we are in a demo mode because i'm not connected into the vpn uh, we can access that later but all those information, the air terminals, we can actually export and import it similar to other applications that I shown you before. Okay, so that's the similar function. So for if if you are not yet, you know, a, a big company with many uh, branches, you're or you just starting. And then you want similar application with Beam Link. I think I suggest you download all the Dirut's Revit application. This one is free. So most of the functions in ID8 Beam Link are in here in Dirut's applications. I mean, I really recommend this Revit application. It's free. You can download it. Anyway, so let's go back again to this tool. So this one, we can manipulate all and control all the information from here, Revit schedule. So all the schedules, equipment schedule, electrical, all the family schedules can be exported and imported back from Revit to Excel, then Excel back to Revit. So that's the function of this one, the Egypt Beam Link. Uh, Explorer is more on, yeah, okay. You can explore what is the, I did not really use this one. For the, uh, it will just check what is the level, correct level of that specific uh, walls like that. So this one, I did not really use this uh, uh, functions here, this option, this. So it's sticky note, this is one is very useful. So this one, okay, enter the mood. Okay, so this one is, you can load here, okay. Can load here the select the excel sheets and then load it here directly in the maybe in the drafting view and then equipment schedule you can drag it and then that one is linked directly in excel so when you updated excel excel sheets 
it will also updated when you reload it here. So let me post this one. I will uh, connect to, to the BFN. Okay, so that we can access the full high date sticky uh, Revit apps application tools. Okay, I will post. So again, we are connected now uh, in the high date sticky. So I'll just select create list in current sheets. Okay, we'll select an uh, Excel sheets, for example. Please change the current view to your sheets. Ah, okay. Mm, okay, okay. Go back going to maybe I will go drafting view. View. This drafting view, okay. Okay, this one. Then going back to edit software, sticky. Oh my gosh! Let me connect first. Again, so I uh, I have said for this this uh, Revit application, I did software. You need a VPN or you need um, access to the swap uh, license. So it's very uh, strict for this one. So again, let's select sticky. Okay, create sheets. Ah, okay. So it's telling. Let's go to the sheets. Okay, can do that. Okay, here. Then sticky. And then create. Then select. I did sticky. I want to go in my documents or tools. So I'm going to this one. I did it my way, okay? Now sheet one, print area, and then select okay. So there you go. And then you select this one and it's already there then you close okay whatever pattern you and settings you place in the sticky notes that's the exact uh, presentation shaded view you know so you should set up properly so this one this is the sheet naming we'll go back also to how to automate the sheets as you can see here there's only two sheets here project bulletin and the xx example so that's the sticky note so when i update this one all the information here is linked directly here so for example the excel i update the excel drawing where's that one show you here example maybe let's replace this D with P okay uh, is it the correct one I think now she placed this one made a mistake okay so maybe I change this one for the D. Maybe I put here uh, find find D. Replace with maybe drainage DR drain. Okay. Close and then you save. After you save, close this one. Go back here. So this one, right? We change and save now. We go to sticky again. Sticky. And then you just have to just select this one, and then update. 
you can update from when you change the folder location but you just directly update it update this one and you will see now it's all image ah i did not drag okay okay fine placement replace all okay save close go to rabbit again you select this one and update and you will see it all updated so this one is a uh, directly also a link uh, so, so some of those it, we have like project with a fast uh, pace and timeline is very short instead of using a uh, actual Revit schedule all the Revit schedule is in Excel usually done by the engineer and then directly link in here in the sheets directly link no need to place it in the equipment schedule so if you have more time and then the requirements is really up uh, with beam standard equipment schedule should be in Revit and not in the Excel link, then you will do that in the other uh, process. But this is the quickest way to place all your schedules, equipment schedule, lighting schedule, from electrical, mechanical, plumbing. Uh, so this is the fastest way. Let's place it here. So, okay, I have four minutes. Okay, going back. After sticky, you can renumber. Also, you can duplicate, manage, and sheets also align, clone, and view creator. So go back again here. I want to... I want to check my sheets and then properties beam link so currently I have this one uh, sheets now uh, this is the car my sheets or uh, maybe I want to add more sheets uh, I don't know if this is the correct correct location to sheet manager sheet manager Let's check. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, uh, let's try. I think a uh, beam link is cannot cannot create sheets automatically. Uh, five sheets. No. Yeah, you cannot create sheets from ID beam link, but you can go here in a sheet manager. Maybe you want a, example this one. You can clone, add new sheets. So maybe that one. You can add also that one. Or you can copy sheets and just view for it. Ah, this one. So you can clone. Maybe you place here. Existing sheets. Clone. Yeah, you cannot really create a sh automatic sheets from here. So let's go resort to another um, application to create sheets. I just better is go to PyRevit and then sheets. This is a bad sheet maker. Okay. Let's open this one and then select this one. So then copy paste. Create sheets. And then this one. Okay. See my sheets now. I will automate now all the information. So I did beam link. I think I, I don't know. Ah, maybe I'm wrong. But let's just check if it will create a sheet. Next. So yeah. So this uh, the most similar from I did software is D roots and this one. Uh, this three D roots. ID software and RF tools. They are more similar in this one. This one is for the export, exporting um, PDF. But I now this is my fav favorite because this one is free. Dirutz. 
So go for the roots, okay? 